hi so in this video we will discuss about different incisions right so as you can see from the video itself so our topic is different incisions and uh, the purpose of the incisions for the OT procedures performed with these incisions right so give me a second first I will like to discuss and then we will come back to the incisions right so first here I will write incisions and in another column I will write the OT procedures performed or the procedures performed right or the you can say surgeries performed <coughs> so first is bar hole incision right or you can say bar hole bar hole is performed in EDH or HDH extra dual hematoma or sub dual hematoma we will learn about uh, EDH and SDH in our head injury section right <coughs> now then there is lazy S or modified layer so this uh, is done in parotidectomy parotidectomy right Then is our collar incision. <coughs> so collar incision is uh, provided uh, in thyroid surgery. And what is the position here? In thyroid surgery, the position is rose position. Also in tonsillectomy, rose position, right? <coughs> Next is our modified showbinger. Modified showbinger, right? SCHOE right modified showbinger for neck dissection <coughs> okay so next is our <coughs> this one elliptical steward incision right elliptical steward is for modified radical mastectomy modified radical mastectomy correct now let's move forward next is our Gillard Thomas Gillard Thomas is for inframemory incision right the named incision right inframemory incision <coughs> next is our cocker incision cocker incision is for open polycystectomy you know that cocker incision for open polycystectomy it is a right subcostal incision one second so it is a right subcostal incision for open coli cockers right okay <coughs> next is our chevron or rooftop so this is for your whipple incision for Whipple's procedure, right? Okay, so next is our <laughs> McBurney. McBurney is for append appendicectomy, right? Appendicectomy. Now there is uh, two incisions. Uh, one is uh, muzzle splitting and muzzle cutting, right? I am writing MS for muzzle splitting, right? And MC for muzzle cutting. Now, muzzle splitting is our grid iron incision for appendicectomy, and muzzle cutting is our Rutherford uh, Morris incision. I am writing RFM Rutherford Morris incision, right? And uh, lastly, is our last but not the least Rocky Davis incision. It is for appendicectomy only. We will revise, uh, don't worry. Okay, so we are revising the entire named incisions. Bar hole incision is for EDH or SDH, lazy S or modified player incision for parotidectomy, collar incision for thyroid surgery, the position is rose position, modified showbinger for neck dissection, elliptical steward incision for modified radical mastectomy, Gilead Thomas incision for inframemory, and 
Hawker's incision for open cholecystectomy. It is a right subposterior incision. Chevroner rooftop for ripples and McBurney for appendicectomy, where muscle splitting is gridiron type and muscle cutting is Rutherford Morrison's. Rocky Davis incision also for appendicectomy. Now we will look where the image and we will try to identify right. <coughs> See, this is your focus. Uh, Focus incision, right subcostal incision for open cholecystectomy. Right? This is your uh, midline incision, and just uh, lateral to the midline is your paramedian incision, right? And this one is a transverse incision that goes transversely, right? Transverse incision. This is your Rutherford Morrison incision for uh, appendicectomy, and remember it is muscle, correct muscle cutting. This is your McBurney incision, right? This is your lunge incision, same for appendicectomy, this is for battle incision, right? And this is your funnel style incision <coughs> for a pelvic procedures, right? So battle incision, lance, McBurney's, Rutherford, these all incisions are for appendicectomy only, right? And remember that appendicectomy there are uh, means uh, these incisions are there for appendicectomy. Apart from that, muscle splitting is the gear iron and muscle cutting is the rather for Morris incision. Important, right? <clears throat> and just remember the locations, right? So, I hope the incisions are clear. And next, we will talk about the margin status of tumors in my next session, right? Thank you.